Hello everybody and welcome back to a new video on my YouTube channel. I'm Nicholas and today we're back with the occasional reaction which we're doing here and there and we have a special reaction to for to today because we are going to be checking out the first official trailer for basically Resident Evil Resident Evil Resident Evil's um own endgame in some way. Yeah, we're going to be checking out the official trailer for Biohazard Death Island. As we can see on the thumbnail, bringing together basically nearly all the main characters across the franchise. Yeah, we got Chris, we got Chill, we got Rebecca, we got Claire, and we got Leon. Yeah, basically only really missing are like Ada and Ethan, but even instead, you know, and some other side characters. So this is going to be huge. Yeah, I think this is the first time we're going to be seeing Leon and Jill on screen. I think it's going to be the first time Chris and uh, Claire re reuniting for quite a while. I must admit, okay, I'm still very, very... Um, um, uneducated when it comes to the full Resident Evil law. Yeah, I've played only the modern Resident Evil games, so everything from um, 7 up to now. So I still have a lot of catching up to do on all the titles, like, you know, the, the first time I with 01 and Veronica, and then the things that happened in between 4 and 7, right? So the Revelation styles and 5 and 6 and all that kind of stuff, right? Still a lot for me to catch up on. Yeah, but I'm still extremely excited for this. Like mentioned, it's going to be the first time Jill and Leon will be in the same project, so... Let's stop the talking and let's start reacting, okay? This franchise has really been growing on me so, so much ever since I discovered it two years ago. So let's check out the trailer. Death Island. I do remember actually... After all she's been through, she's trying to make up for what Having watched very old Resident Evil movies as a kid. No one's blaming Jill for that. No one. Except Jill. She'll be looking insane though. I do know a lot of people are. Ooh. Doctor Taylor. Yes, we need him in custody ASAP. Ooh, Leo with his bike. We got from a bite wound on an orca carcass. It had a strain of tea in it. You're kidding. I just I recently finished folks that were her RE2 run. She's all also Alcatraz recently. So fun. Okay. Well, Doctor Taylor, it's time we debuted our. <sighs> all five. On one island, and it's just gonna be an all out rumble, huh? Who is it? Leon vs. Jill? Oh shit, that's gotta be hot. Leon and Jill properly together, man. I'm going to use my virus to clean the slate. But who's that, though? Who's Dylan? You're nothing more than pawns. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Oh shit, this has gotta be so sick, dude. Jill is going off. They're really giving her some some heavy scenes here. Of course, Chris with the big guns. The final stage now. Oh, but his face looks so familiar. No justice. Well, it's over now, asshole. I think it's the same voice actor as Ari Free, huh? Time to light you up. Let's do it, all of us. Ooh. Oh, so it's gonna be some. <laughs> Claire with the spin. Death Island. Oh, that looked like a. Definitely going on vacation after this. <laughs> And it wouldn't be an RE project without a cheesily on one-liner. <laughs> oh yeah, you definitely need a vacation after this and that. I have no idea where this is happening in the timeline, by the way. I have no idea how long it's been since 4 or 2 or whatever. Apparently I saw some people say like 2015, 2016, which in, in story would mean Leon would be like... Maybe 30 years? Above 30 already? Again, I, I'm, I'm very uneducated with the with the lore and everything, so please tell me the majority of information you can tell me about this project down below. But, ooh, this looks so good. Like I mentioned, it's really just going to be... I mean, it's only the thing with Resident Evil, right? The lore is always interesting, but the, 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 the key point that sells all of it is just badass characters being badass and shooting monsters, right? That's what we're here for, and I think this is exactly what it's going to be like. Just an entertainment package with fantastic action sequences and 
this looks so promising in that department especially. Okay, like me, just gonna be great seeing them all come together, right? Again, like mentioned, I just recently finished um, um the Claire second run on RE2, also very, very cool um lead character. Again, still a lot to go through, including her and other characters, but again, not sure about her or him. I'm not sure who's Dylan, if he was already a thing before, and if he's just Dylan for this movie, right? Like a one and off type of guy. But again... They're visiting Alcatraz together and the Myers breaks out and it's just going to be them slaughtering through the masses, right? It's going to be so fun. Yeah, it will be such an easy, enjoyable, entertaining watch. You know, nothing you really need to go in with, like, um... You don't really, I think you won't really need to prepare for it, right? I think that's exactly why I'm looking forward to this so much. Because even I, as a rather new Resident Evil fan, who's really only played the modern, recent games, can go into this and just fully enjoy it all the way through, right? Ah, it's going to be so fun. Again, though, I do remember hearing, oh, this scene, though, we gotta get Leon versus Jill and then them together, too. That's gotta be insane. They are basically in some way, like, the trademark, right? Um, I think Leon and Jill are probably the most beloved male and female characters, respectively, so them finally getting together on screen and having some action is pretty, pretty damn dope. Obviously, Chris and, and Claire together. Rebecca, like, mentions the one I'm the, 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 the least um, familiar with just yet, because I haven't played a game yet that really included her, right? Like, I know Chris from R8 and Claire you know obviously from um two and then jill from r3 so i'm very good to see more of rebecca but yeah this is going to be just so fun again it's such a sick shot here with them all together i do must say by the way i do remember hearing that jill apparently has like because of the virus she got she's aging slower or something again this is apparently after resident evil 5 as well where i think she's also appearing in with blonde hair if i'm not mistaken i think i sadly got that spoiled already but you know um so yeah timeline wise and why people look the way they do and everything it's Again, I won't be caring too much about all of that. I'm just here for an action-packed movie with characters I really, really love and have been growing towards to over the past few years. So this is exactly what this project is going to be, okay? This is looking sick. We have some great action sequences in here. We got Chris with the big guns, as always, right? He's probably going to pull the punch or shark or something as well. We will see. <laughs> but yeah, and again, this is also like a 1v5 boss fight here. Ah, oh, this is looking so good. I'm excited, y'all. Resident Evil slash Biohazard Death Island. It's going to be a fun, quick, enjoyable, action-packed movie with all of our favorites coming together again. Would have loved to see Ada in there as well, but then probably Leon wouldn't be able to focus on anything else in here, so who knows. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to this, and I hope you guys are as well. Like mentioned, we recently had the Resident Evil 4 remake on this channel, I played through it in its entirety, and... Maybe I will be playing for all the other Resident Evil games on this channel as well. Maybe we'll be replaying 2, 7, and 8 as bonus projects here down the road just to have a play for all of it online as well. We will see about all of that. But now I hope you enjoyed this video and enjoyed the reaction. If you did, leave a like to show me that you did. Your thoughts on the trailer down below in the comments. And as always, if you enjoyed what I'm doing, if you want to support me, let leave us up as well. It will tell me. Oh, look forward to much more gaming and Resident Evil and other types of content on this channel. And for now, I say stay safe, even happy, and see you again soon.